is. To talk about this weekend's premiere, then the voice of Heavy Rescue 401, Dave Pettit joins us now. Dave, always great to talk to you. We, we love talking about the show. We love talking about trucks in weather. Tell us about this season. What has you pumped about this new season? Well, hi. First off, hello, everyone. Hi, and uh, and congratulations. First, I got to say to Alex, 10 years. Oh, it's amazing. Thank you. I'm so thank proud you, of you. Thank you, Dave. I need yeah. you to do like a voice yeah. for me at the end. I'm going to. Okay. Yeah, you, you start right. You just say the word. Okay, perfect. I think this season, this season is spectacular i mean it's i think what really steps out to me is i mean obviously it's this kind of catch-22 you you want good wrecks but at the same time it's like oh man that's affecting people's lives but for me i think the thing that really stood out this year was how, just how hard uh those teams work together there's so much teamwork between the teams and uh i don't know that was the part that stuck out to me uh the most this season just how how those guys know each other, how well they work together, and how they're always just, you know, no matter the circumstances, willing to lend a hand to each other, too. So, so Dave, when you narrate these, do you watch the entire episode, or do you kind of narrate but then like to watch it all play out on your screen? I'd, I'm like everybody else. I want to see it come out at the end. I want to I want to be surprised by just how good that narrator could be sometimes. <laughs> but... Uh, <laughs> No, it's I have access. I do watch the shows kind of ahead of time, but you know, most of the time it's I get a script and the team, you know, they all the between the writers who say, How would they pet it say this? And you know, the just the 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 way that after seven years of putting this show together, it's I think we got a pretty good uh, system for for just getting in and getting getting the easy work done for a lot of folks because there's again there's so many people behind the scenes putting in the real hard work not to, like most most obviously the guys out on the road so Dave do you ever get a script and you read through it and you're, and you're like oh my god wait are you, you do like a double take you're like what happened that cannot be real did yeah. you ever get any surprises like that Oh man it's uh, some of the first off some of the big wrecks and such i mean obviously th those are going to just blow my mind I, sometimes some funny script comes up but i think the one that got me the most over the years was the time that it was a uh, a flaming wreck of juice boxes and they had to wait for you know they had to wait for the fire to go out before uh, before they could handle it it was like this raging inferno but uh, man i feel oh, like you just described weather underground yeah <laughs> <laughs> we are right. a flaming rack of juice boxes, aren't we? Well, I Dave, hope, yeah, I hope not. <laughs> do you ever find yourself like driving in traffic and like narrating what's happening around you? <laughs> <laughs> Every once in a while, I'll put up like a TikTok or something as we're driving to the, you know, to the Great Bear Snowshed on the Coquihalla, or you know, I mean, because we're out on the West Coast, yeah. I don't drive through the four. You're, I don't know if you could pay me to drive through the 400 system, knowing what knowing what I know about that area. But uh, you know, it's yeah, it's I. I think my wife kind of does it to me a little bit more often. She'll uh, she'll ask me for my take on it. But uh, yeah, it's I I try to just stick that or stay with that in the studio. All right, Dave. So you know, um, you alluded to it already. This is uh, Alex's 10-year anniversary here at the uh, the Weather yep. Channel, and I feel like just us saying congratulations just doesn't cut it. Yeah. Can you take it away? No, Alex. This country has come to love you. They count on you. Your opinion changes people's lives, whether it's dangerous or it's a breath of fresh air at the uh, Groundhog's Day Festival. <laughs> You are an incredible asset to this community, and we absolutely appreciate everything you do and, and hope for 10, 20, however many more years you've got left in you, we'll, uh, we'll take every last one we can get. Dave, you are the best. I thought he was going to say something like, she's not older, she's just weathered. <laughs> <laughs> Which would also work for like a highway through hell on rescue 401 tagline, right? All right, I'd like to change all of that sentiment into something a little bit. No, no I'm kidding. Yours was so, uh... so thoughtful. Mine was, mine was truck like. You are the Weather Channel's sweetheart, Alex Wilson. Dave, Dave congratulations on best. another great season. Thank you. Good to talk to you. Thank you.